You're watching the Mr. Quality Guy YouTube channel. Hello everyone, Mr. Quality Guy here, and today's video is going to be on critical dimensions and what are critical dimensions to the design process. So sit back and relax, and let's get to it. Right, so what are critical dimensions? Critical dimensions are dimensions that are deemed important to either the assembly or safety of the product for its, of the product. For example, the seatbelt claps are going to be critical for their sizes as it is a safety item, while the splines on a drive shaft will be critical for assembly and part functionality. But how do I identify them? Critical dimensions will always be listed on the GDT blueprint, and these dimensions will also also be marked with a unique identifier such as an I or CIC or whatever the customer uses when checking random samples. It is important to check any and all critical dimensions of the components at a minimum. So for example, if you have a bunch of drive shafts you have to check, at the minimum you should check any critical dimensions that are on those drive shafts. You don't have to inspect every single feature as that would be time consuming and you know, would be not worth the cost in doing so. However, at checking the critical dimensions of them will reduce your cost, but also increase the safety of the product and allow you to ensure that you are getting good product. So that's all for that video. Thank you and have a great day. That was just a short video on critical dimensions. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you have any more questions or you would like to see a video on something else, put a message down below and I'll get to it. Thank you and have a great day.